On this episode of Dirt Road Traveler, we're in Porto, in Portugal. From the cathedral, we get to our hotel for the next three nights. The Tapestry by Hilton. Let's have a look inside. It's pretty cool. First, there's the library dining area. That's really quite cool. But check out the reception area. Gonna love staying here. All right, so let's check out room 21. Wow, okay, this is cool. Check out the headboard and even the neon. I love this idea after a very hectic 15 days, let's stay in bed. Let's check out the bathroom. And wow, wow, concrete floor, Got a little bit of a safety rail for if we've had a beer or two too many. Nice, actually very funky sink area. And again, something that will make me a very happy person, a coffee maker. We are going to love our time here in Porto. If you uh, know Team Dirt Road Traveler, you know that we have a priority today. When in a city with a hard rock cafe, it means a classic burger, a t-shirt, and a beer. Hello everyone, um, I thought I'd report today. We are at the hard rock cafe and this is Elvis Presley, Elvis Presley display. Um, you see his shirt that he wore and took of him with some girls from the Elvis Presley Museum. That's his karate match. Here. Getting Hard rock visit, always fun. Pistachio ice cream, Funner. chocolate ice cream, Funner. always fun. <laughs> what? Funner. Funner, not funner. This is fun. <laughs> this is fun. This is kind of cool. Look at all the flowers adorning the balcony railings. Okay. I don't normally take cat videos. So this one is dedicated to our friend Eric in Texas, but that cat is huge. I'll admit I didn't buy any candy, but this place has got some really cool stuff going on. Well, when in Portugal, one of the things that we had to accomplish was finding a geocache in our 51st country. And if you know, you know.
I think we're gonna walk to the other side. So what is the fantastic world of Portuguese camp? Let's find out. And it is wall to wall, floor to ceiling. Sardines. Even Cindy is confused by the concept. to say I love these tile facades on so many of the buildings. side of the Doro they have this amazing gondola and somehow Mrs. Dirt Road Traveler and I got a private car so we're going down to start trying out some ports in Porto. Tram was fun. We're uh, climbing this crazy hill going up to Graham's Port Lodge. Let's uh, see what we've got in store for us up here. And here we are at Graham's. It's worth the walk up the hill, I hope. And now we're pouring the 1990 vintage of Graham's Tawny. just taste it coming out of the bottle and watching it go into the glass. This looks like a wonderful noon o'clock day starter. And check out the view while we sample our port. Okay, this went really, really well. Could not imagine enjoying port as much as I did. And this 30 year old port, this last sip that's left before we go, was absolutely amazing. So Graham's thank you, two thumbs up. I think it's time for us to walk down and jump in a boat and do a tour of the Doro. And for a little bit of a smile, that dog is loving the belly rub. Oh my. You wanna go for a boat cruise? Let's go for a boat cruise. Okay, we're gonna go for a boat cruise. Wanna go for a boat cruise? Let's go for a boat cruise. Let's go for a boat cruise. And our cruise has begun, and it's time for Dos Cerveza.
this area, the roadway was too narrow for cars, so they built a small bridge. Okay, we've had Port O'Clock, and now we have Super Bock O'Clock here. Now that is a nice looking pizza. Mmm. There are some absolutely incredible sight lines too. Just look up this street. doing a bit of advanced scouting. This is where we're having dinner this evening. Can't wait to be here. Eh, the eye candy here never ends. It's unbelievably cool. Sadly, this church has fallen into disrepair. So beautiful at one time. They say this is the most magnificent McDonald's in the world. In English, you're welcome and not my restaurant, but where I work. Okay? Thank you so much. Yeah. And our entrees have arrived. Cindy is having oven roasted codfish with potatoes and another vegetable mix. And Tim is having octopus with potatoes, also oven roasted, and it looks beautiful. We just met Ana from Brazil, and we're in Porto, Portugal. But you know what? She's become our daughter, and she's actually our third daughter that we've adopted. Well, dinner is over. And as you can see, what was formerly full of pulpo and cod is empty. Stomachs are full. Taberna Dona Antonia is the place in Porto for authentic Portuguese food. Wasn't that an amazing dinner last night? Oh my goodness. We've loved our time so far in Porto and we've got another day left. So, Mrs. Dirt Road Traveler has decided we're going to walk to the ocean. That away. Uh, figure it's about an hour and a half, yeah, to get there. So, we don't know what we're gonna see along the way. We're hoping this noise that's surrounding us right now ends uh, as we get out there. Anyways, if you've enjoyed this video, please think about giving us a streetcar. Uh, think about giving us a thumbs up and if you're enjoying the Dirt Road Traveler experience 
think about giving us that subscribe or we'll send you notifications when there's new videos but no spam or anything like that okay let's go for a walk one of the spectacular views on this walk so far the mural of tile on the back of this church. So we're currently about five and a half kilometers from the hotel and we've come to this little grouping of very tiny homes and behind them as you'll see through here is another row of tiny little homes. Very cute, very crooked, but very cool as well. And another mix, this one with old and new. And from the looks of it, the center building with the pink tile is actually two units. Lots and lots of fishing boats. Many of them are just come in. And there's one arriving right now, so we're gonna head over and see how his catch went. Quite the catch. hear that other than those running steps you can hear the sound of the ocean behind us it sounds great hey hope you've enjoyed this video we're heading to Lisbon for our next stop on this journey and hope you'll enjoy that video too but thanks very much for watching Dirt